Hello and welcome to Headphones Lab. My name is Sarah and in this video I'll be listing what the best studio headphones are out there. Headphones are all a matter of personal preference and weighing out the pros and cons. That's why we decided to help you out with this task by giving you our five best studio headphone picks while also explaining why we have picked them. So let's get right into it. First up with our best value for money pick, we have the Audio Technica ATH M40XS. Their sound is generally as neutral as it can be for the price you pay. Build quality is pretty decent, mainly plastic, but the headphones still feel very sturdy. Great removable cable along with pads that are extremely easy to swap out. Included ear pads are pretty soft, though clamping force is a little tight. The noise isolation is good in a studio environment, not so much for the outside world. Our next pick is our best mid-range studio headphones. We have chosen the HD 600. The open back design gives them quite a lot of soundstage without sacrificing imaging which is rather impressive. These are perfect for mixing as you can use them accurately, balance the sound and place the instruments. There is zero noise isolation. They are useless for live monitoring or outdoor usage. The sound is amazing on them and the padding is pretty soft, though the pro propriety cables are hard to replace. The clamping force is noticeable, but with big pads the pressure is spread equally. The headphones are mostly plastic but still the build quality is amazing. Next we have our best budget option, which we have chosen the AKG K240 Studio. These headphones are semi-open back, meaning a part of their enclosure is closed. This gives them more soundstage while still delivering a tiny bit of noise isolation. These headphones have a balanced mids and highs but very weak bass that rolls off extremely quickly. There is brilliant comfort with these, the clamp isn't strong and the ear pads don't feel rough. The build quality isn't great with them but this is a budget option and we still do recommend. Up next we have our best closed back studio headphones which are the Biodynamic DT770 Pro. These headphones deliver great bass and mids, but are slightly sharp. Due to the closed back design, they naturally offer much better noise isolation than open back headphones. Also, a much stronger bass that's not over amplified. Comfort wise, ear pads are soft with plenty of padding on top. The clamping force may be too much for some people though. The build quality is quite possibly the best on this list. Most of the parts seem to be made of metal, and the headphones headphones feel extremely sturdy and durable. Finally, we have our best open back studio headphones, which we have chosen the HD 800S. These are the most expensive pick on the list, but you do get a gold standard for comfort, all round superb sound that's neutral yet dynamic, great build quality, and some of the widest ear cups we've seen. Although keep in mind finding a replacement cable isn't the easiest with these headphones. So guys, I hope our list of best studio headphones has helped you. All the product links will be down in the description below along with our article link for more information. Please give us a like and subscribe because it really helps us and hit the notification bell while you're down there for any more videos and information. Thank you so much for watching guys and see you in the next one.